Hi everyone, my name is Tyler Oakley, and if you don't like first world problems, if you get annoyed by people like me complaining about things that don't really matter, you can turn this video off because, girl, I've got two things for you today. I have been plagued by these issues, and they have really just affected my well-being. Uh, first issue being, I have been, I have this problem, okay, and I have even, like, I have tried to fix it, I have gone to the doctor, I have asked him for advice, I was like, Henny, help a bitch. And he's like, just fucking fix it. Um, I, I have been biting the same spot on my lip <laughs> for like a few weeks now. And you may, thinking, you may be thinking like, girl, like fucking like, that seems like a personal issue. Like if you really want to stop, you'll stop. I can't stop. Every meal, I accidentally, but I think I get really excited when I eat, so that could be part of the problem. But also just like at times, like I'll be walking, I'll be hanging out, I'll be sitting, I'll just bite it and it's like, why am I bleeding? This is my fault. I've done this to myself. The other day I was sitting on that couch, and I'll get back to the couch and problem too, um, but I was sitting on that couch about to enjoy a fine dining experience. I had just gotten um, orange chicken from Panda Express. I brought it all the way home. I was driving home thinking, wow, this is about to be the best fucking experience of my entire life. I sit down on that couch. I turn on an episode of season five of The Amazing Race because I'm watching it and it's a really good season and I know that we're on season 28 right now, but like I wanted to catch up. I wanted to enjoy this experience. I had a Coke Zero. I was ready for it. I was getting in the mode, getting in the, like the, the, the space to enjoy that experience. Sit down, take one fucking bite of my orange chicken and I think it was the excitement, but it could have been, could have been anything, truly. Um, I bit right into my my lip, the same spot that I've been biting into. I bite into it so much, so often, that it's about to like fucking callous up. Times are tough. Um, and my entire orange chicken experience was plagued by the taste of blood. And I literally, I stood up and I went, are you kidding me? Because this is something that's been going on. And now that I vocalize it, and I already vocalized it to my doctor, I literally went to my doctor um, and I was like, is there something I can do? And he's literally looking at me like, I'm a crazy person, which I am, and he's like, maybe just like, like, be more careful. And I think it's committed to muscle memory at this point. I've been chomping and chomping and chomping and now my, I think that's just the way my teeth go. So that's my first first world problem. My second first world problem of today, I was sitting on that couch, the one that's previously been plagued by my blood situation, sitting on that couch, trying to mind my business today in a home that I rent myself. I pay all the rent. I bought that couch. This place is for me. It's my safe haven. And should I expect to be assaulted in my home? No. Yet, and yet, there I was, sitting right there, on contraire, okay, bitch? Like, thinking I can be safe. No, no, on contraire, mademoiselle, French, sitting right there, I and I see in the reflection of my glasses, and I always think, oh, was that, like, <gasps> oh my god, literally, right now, tingle on my leg hair, I think I just touched my chair, but it was literally flashbacks to what I'm literally talking about right now. I see a reflection in my, my glasses. I am tense right now, I think, is what's going on. I see a reflection in my glasses, and I think, okay, well, maybe it's like a GIF on my screen. Maybe it's like the reflection of a reflection of a reflection. Because with glasses, you have to kind of like just accept the fact that sometimes you see and you think it's in front. Anyway, no, bitch. It was a fucking spider the size of not big, but still. And I scream, I jump up. It, thank God I didn't bite my fucking, that would have been a double whammy. But I scream, I jump up. It's literally, if you follow me on Snapchat, you saw the entire endeavor. It was crawling around on my couch that I bought. And you think, oh, just kill it. No, I don't have the power or the, or the, the strength or anything within me to be able to do something like that. No, I just, now for six hours I've been on this side of the room because this is where I am here today and I'm trying to enjoy my life, but no, this the, the spider's over there today, so the spider gets that side of the room. And he, I'm, yes, maybe just pack your bags and burn the place down. Maybe that is suitable. You never know if he's got family, you know if he does, or she, I don't mean to gender the spider. But Lord have mercy. And I know spiders are supposed to like fucking kill the other bugs and like good for your home and like whatever the fuck, but no bitch, not in my home. It almost made me bite my lip. So times have been tough, but I am getting through it thanks to your prayers. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I have just, it's been a struggle today. Um, and I know, they're first world problems, and I'll fucking live, and like literally count your blessings, and grass is always greener, and eat my ass, whatever the fuck, I don't care. 
that's just where I'm at today, okay? Been biting my lip and running from spiders. What are you up to? Let me know your first world problems in the comments below. I'd like to know, what what's getting your goat? What's What does that phrase mean? Can I, whose goat have you been getting? Like, why are you fucking a goat? Ugh, I gotta go. Give this video a thumbs up. Or fucking don't. <laughs> Bitch, I gotta go. Uh, <coughs> going through it. Okay. Bye. Give this video a thumbs up, I guess. Who, who's texting me at this hour?